see me, I'm hiding. I'm going to be hiding for the whole episode of The Tonight Show, At Home Edition tonight. Let's see if you can, oh, did you see me move? Did you see? Nah. Did you see? Just kidding. Hi, everybody. <laughs> All new Tonight Show, At Home Edition starts now. We in the house. Come on. Tonight, join Jimmy and his guests. Shailene Woodley, Maluma, musical guest Tom York, and the legendary Roots crew. It's the Tonight Show at Home edition. We in the house, y'all. And now, here's Jimmy. Hey, everyone. Welcome to Tonight Show at Home edition. Uh, this is the hidden episode because... We tried to make the space into a, a room where we might do some jokes from, but the acoustics are pretty bad and the lighting isn't great. Um, the wallpaper is great for what the room normally is, but not for this. So we tried to make it look like a setup, but it's not a setup. Anyway, so this is a kind of a hidden episode because we'll, we'll never shoot like this ever again. This will be the first and last time we broadcast from this exact space doing exactly this. So you found me. You found the hidden episode. Congratulations. <laughs> uh, well, let's get to some jokes here, everybody. Uh, Costco announced that starting next week, all customers will have to wear face masks. It's good because now you can stay anonymous while you buy six gallons of cheese balls. I love cheese balls. You do. But what did we get them? We did get them in like a bucket. Or like a plastic. Every summer. Every summer. It's, it just it tastes better the more you, no one eats them. Three months in, they're even better. <laughs> they almost become a gelatinous uh, cheese ball. One big ball. <laughs> they become spreadable. Uh, meanwhile, a new undercover video apparently shows Home Depot employees refusing to wear masks at work. And people are shocked. They said, Home Depot has employees? Where? Hello? Hello? No? No? I need help. No. I just, just don't know where where to get get a uh, ball bean hammer hammer. Anyone work here here? I um, guess I just use the self checkout checkout. That was my echo training. I saw that Disney World is trying to reopen, and they're considering asking guest asking guests to wear masks. It might be necessary, but it also takes the fun out of seeing a photo of yourself on the roller coaster looking like this. You gotta do a lot of eye work. For the whole time, because you never know when they're gonna take the flash either. There's, there's, they'll still charge you for that photo though. Don't worry about that. Uh, for the first time ever, movies that were streaming only will now be eligible for Academy Awards. They made the switch after realizing the only movies in theaters this year would have been Sonic the Hedgehog and Doolittle who just announced that all the world's major film festivals are going to be cons consolidated into one virtual event that you can view online. They've even come up with a catchy name for it. Netflix. In a new interview, Dr. Fauci said, we're not ready for sports to come back yet. I don't know, I, I think I was ready yesterday when I watched eight hours of the World Series of Solitaire. Well, this is great. Yesterday, the cast of Melrose Place reunited to raise money for struggling actors, which means all the money raised will go to the cast of Melrose Place. I saw that an 11-year-old boy in Colorado caught a trout the size of a toddler. Uh, at least that's what he said until his mom was like, Ugh, please unhook your brother. I read about a beekeeper in London who uses the sounds from his hives to make electronic music. So anytime you're stressed during quarantine, just remember, you could be living with that guy. Uh, Finally, I heard about a group of German doctors who posed naked online to raise awareness for their lack of protective equipment. They taught me two things. One, doctors everywhere need our support. Number two, it is still cold in Germany in April. 
There you guys have it. That is our monologue right there. I appreciate that. Thank you for uh, uh, listening to us. We have a great show tonight. First of all, I want to say Salesforce is helping us out. Uh, anything you can donate to Salesforce between, uh, to, sorry, to World Central Kitchen between now and June 1st, Salesforce will match up to $250,000. So you can text MEALS to 80100 and that will totally help and totally work. I think it charges your phone a dollar. You can do it really quickly. You can do it right now. Have your kids do it. Show your kids how to donate. Uh, this is how you do it, kids. Uh, and uh, Salesforce, thanks for stepping up. That's awesome that you're doing that. Uh, we have a great show tonight. Shailene Woodley is on the show tonight. Uh, I love talking to Shailene. Uh, normally, I would, you know, I would give her a hug. Clearly, we can't do it. I don't even know if people are going to hug anyway. But she taught me a cool hug for those of you with people that you can hug. I can hug you, honey. But what she does is she hugs the opposite way, so our, our hearts touch. Mm. Wow, that's cute. And so I've done that a couple times. Shown that to a couple people that I like that. But that always reminds me of Shailene Woodley. Uh, also, Maluma. Gosh, this guy's on fire. He's just the biggest of all big. I love Maluma. Um, after he did that uh, concert, by the way, that we that we did, the Lady Gaga um, uh, One World Together at Home, his song went to number one that he did, Carna Carnival. Carnival went to number one um, uh, because he's great. Uh, and then... Speaking of music, so check this out. You're not even going to believe this story. Tom York from Radiohead. Tom York was thinking about what song to do for our show. We love Tom York. We love Radiohead. Tom, a piece of paper falls out of his uh, piano thing, and it's a song that he, he didn't know if he was going to finish or not. He finished it for our show. Plasticine Figures. The debut of the song. Never been heard outside of Tom York's brain will be played tonight for you guys. Tom York, brand new song, Plasticine Figures. What? That is the coolest thing ever. I love you, Tom York. Uh, hey guys, it's time for a little thing called What Are You Doing Wednesday? This first one here, a lot of the first three are dad ones. This first one is from uh, at Siobhan Blair, helps his baby out with a top secret mission. Should you choose to accept it? Uh, this next one is a dad. He likes to multitask uh, while making dinner. He has to do other things. Watch. Parent of the year right there. I love that move. Parent of the year. That's good. Cooking and pulling the swing. Uh, this next one is from at Sid Evelyn Babies. Uh, her, her sister told her dad about her bad grades, and her dad came in to talk to her about it. Watch. You had two tests? I did this. You had a 53 and a 60. You can cheat. It's online. I did cheat. And you still got a 53 yes. and a 60. No way, he's the dad of the year. <laughs> Honey, you you cheated and still, well, cheat better next time. You cheated and still <laughs> failed? <laughs> that was great. Uh, this last one here just kind of uh, made me feel good. It's a neighborhood uh, sent from Laurent Fournel, posted a video of her neighborhood doing a socially distant line dance. Uh, it's pretty cool, check it out. Makes you feel good. That is awesome, guys. Uh, congrats to everyone who just joined in and did that. That must have been a cool moment for everyone. We'll be right back with more Tonight Show, everybody. Two kids coloring together. 
Some friends celebrating a holiday. Lovers caught in an embrace. An office hard at work. A mixed race family caught in a candid moment. And a sad boy looking out of the window. We may not be able to make commercials right now, but we can still make pictures zoom in and out. Stock images.